slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, we are going to compare the newest and the rarest Sword Style in Anime Fighting Simulator. Gamer Nom, why are you making this video? Because guys, if you are doing the Fight Pass, you are about to unlock the N6 style. And if ever you have the Moon style, if you equip the N6 style, you will lose the Moon style. That's why I am making this video for us to compare it and to help you decide what Sword Style is better for you. If you're gonna ask me, insect style is easier to get, you just need 40,000 Shikara shards and grind till you reach tier 30 so you can get it for sure and it will be permanent in your inventory. For the moon style, for me it is harder because you only have a 1.78% chance of acquiring it and even if you have 1 million Shikara shards, if you're not that lucky, then you will not get it. But again, if you're lucky, even if you only have 2,000 Shikara shards, you can unlock it. So if you're gonna ask me, Moon style is harder to unlock. And if ever you change sword styles, this will not go into your inventory. So for this try, I rolled 24 times and spent 48,000 Chikara shards just to unlock the Moon style. What do you think guys? Which sword style is harder to unlock? Is it the insect style or the Moon style? Comment it on the comment section. So next up, I will be showing you the best champion to use with this sword styles, okay? So we are here in the dummy area to try the damage. First up with Asuna, we are using Moon Style, third skill, there you go. First damage is 31.26 DE. Why Moon Style, third skill? Because the skill factor of this is sword, okay? And this is a sword skill. So this is the best skill to test. Next up, we have Escanor with 31.03 DE damage. Guys, as you can see, the sun is up, still up. Which means this is the maximum damage this Escanor can do. Again, 31.03, which means Asuna has a higher damage. Asuna, guys. <laughs> Next up, Zenitsu, 28.24 DE, lower. Okay, lower than Asuna. And last but not the least, we have, I think, Mihawk. Yeah, Mihawk. The nerf Mihawk. <laughs> you see that? 20.17 DE. Okay. Okay, so this decides it. We are going to use Asuna in the boss fights and just the boss fights, okay? Okay, so now I am going to show you how strong Moon style in boss fights. Don't worry, we are going to compare it with the insect style. Again, we are comparing the newest and the rarest Moon style. I mean, sorry, <laughs> sword style. My bad, my bad. Tao lang, tao lang. Okay, now we have Kurama here with 1k HP, right? Okay, you see that? You get you will be hitting your enemy twice with 182 damage, which means the damage is one a uh, 300 something, 364. Yeah, 364. Let's increase the damage by activating the explosive nova. Did, oh, did you see that? The HP of the boss disappeared. Again, I will be showing you the other skills because yeah, I think this is the best skill for boss fights now. Thank you for those who corrected me with that. Okay, again, one more time. C skill, you will be hitting your enemy twice with that. So 318 times 2, that's like 636, right? Wow, correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Did you see that guy is so strong? We're not even using other skills. Okay, now let's compare it with the insect style. Okay. We will be using for the highest damage, okay? I think the C skill. We have the C skill for that. Let's check it out. Boom. It really looks cool. For the C skill, the damage is almost 200. 170. No, no, no. 185. Sorry. <laughs> now, we've tried the second skill. See that? Less than 100, I guess. Something like that. 100 plus or less than 100. Now, we're going to use the Explosive Nova with Asuna. Okay, so guys, I don't want to compute the damage, but comparing it to Moon Style, I think the winner in this round, if we're gonna compare them, is the Moon Style, right? Yes, the Moon Style's winner with a damage of 600. Oh, that's so strong, guys. That's so strong. Okay. Well, next up, let's try it in the tournament dimension. Okay, now, Moon Style first. Let's try the damages. 
Okay, so for the initial damage, this is 51. Not bad with Asuna. As again, the enemy is using Spring Limbs. Okay. For those asking, why am I not using the Legendary Super Saiyan? Because it has higher defense, guys. Aerosis doesn't have that. Okay. As you can see, second skill. It's not so good in tournament dimensions because you cannot hit your enemy. I mean, you cannot point your mouse. It's random. For the last skill, the damage is 82. Okay? 82. Now, we're gonna try the Explosive Nova. Again, guys, if you're thinking you're gonna use this in tournament dimension, guys, think twice. You need to stun your enemy first, right? For the first skill, the damage is 88. Not bad. It's kinda high. Considering your enemy's HP is 250. For the second skill, oh, 16. But again, it's very hard to hit your enemy with that. That's why if you're ever gonna use this in the tournament dimension, just use the third skill. But again, it's hard to hit the enemy with this skill too. Okay, so next we're gonna try the insect style. Guys, for the insect style, I think this style is better in tournament dimension. The X skill of this style is like the flash dance. You see that even if you're not looking at your enemy, as long as you're within range, you can damage it. So for the damage, 12 times 4 plus 6, that's 54. But if you want to get the maximum damage with the champion, you need to use Escanor. Why? Because the skill factor of this skill is not sword, it's chakra. See that? 18 times 4 plus 8. I think it's 80, right? Okay. Guys, again, we are not using Explosive Nova here. Damage can still increase. Okay, so now, why N6 style is better in tournament dimension? For example, you want to attack your enemy you're using Moon Style. To get near, you need to stun your enemy, right? Why? What if your enemy is running? It's very hard to do that. But if you use Sun's, uh, I mean Insect Style, yeah, or Sun Style, and you have the X skill, you see that you don't need to go near your enemy. Attack him with that. Even if you're within a rock, as long as you're within range, see that. So this is what will happen if you are fighting an enemy. Okay, 4, 3, 2, 1, run towards him, X, you see that, stun, skills, blah blah blah, blah blah blah, and it's done. Compared to moon style, you need to stun your enemy first, what if again your enemy will stun you first, etc, blah blah blah, okay? Okay, so as a conclusion, if you're looking for a sword style that's built for boss fights, then choose the moon style but again guys if you equip the insect style you will lose this moon style okay and if you're looking for a sword style built for pvp we have here the insect sword style again the x skill of this is almost the same as the flash dance of the sun style okay okay so i hope that this video helped you decide on which sword style to use again this is gamer and gamer out